As I record this episode, we are one day away from National Say Something Nice Day. How can you and I use this day to, well, make the world a better place? Let's you and I discuss that in this episode of Kindness Makes the World a Better Place and Easy Stress Cures. Steve Carter, your host for Easy Stress Cures and Kindness Makes the World a Better Place. I'm going to share this episode in both shows for two reasons. One, we know that when we are kind, when we say nice things to other people, there are biochemical processes in our brains and bodies that lower stress, that create positive emotional states within each of us. And of course, the mission of our podcast, Kindness Makes the World a Better Place, is to celebrate acts of kindness and encourage all of us to do more kind things in the world to make the world a better place. So, how can we use National Say Something Nice Day to benefit the world and to benefit us? First, I would recommend that you look for opportunities to say nice words. Look for opportunities to say nice words. Encourage your own mindset to be on the lookout for those opportunities and to engage others with either formal or casual conversations that allow you to say nice words and to be kind. Where do we begin? I recommend beginning with voicing kind words about yourself. Bring to mind something you did well. Bring to mind something you did well Relive that experience in the theater of your mind and really celebrate your success. Celebrate that success. Tell yourself you really did a great job on that project, in that situation, in that conversation. Give yourself props for what you did well. You can also recall kind acts that you did for others. Kind acts that you did for pets, for animals, or for the environment. Acknowledge those kind acts and celebrate yourself for doing so. Acknowledge those kind acts and celebrate the fact that you engaged in such positive activity. What about saying nice things to other people? I suggest you make a point to speak kind words to your spouse, to your significant other, to your children, to your parents, if you're lucky enough to still have them on this planet. Speak nice words to other family members. Offer heartfelt compliments and words of appreciation. Give thought about what you really appreciate about your spouse, your significant other, your children, your parents, other family members, bring into awareness the felt sense of that appreciation and then make a point to actually tell them that you truly do appreciate them and tell them why. Tell them how glad you are that they are in your life. Expanding out from our family, make a point to speak kind words to neighbors co-workers, store clerks, and people you engage in conversations day in and day out. Take a few moments, send an email to a company acknowledging an employee who provided great service, or share a positive post on social media. I frequently shop at the local Safeway near my home in Ellicott City, Maryland, and there are employees that have been with that store for years. Whether it's a long-term employee or someone new, when I receive exceptional service, 
I always find the manager on duty, and I make a point to comment about that great service. This not only benefits the employee who delivered the great service, but consider that the manager of the store likely hears people complain about some product that's not on the shelf, something that has been mispriced, or at least in their opinion has been mispriced, or they have some other complaint. Not only does the employee who gave that great service receive the benefits of your compliment, but you have also elevated the emotional state of the manager. And the fact that I am engaged in positive commentary, positive words, nice words, praising an employee who provided great service, my emotional state is also elevated. When you give a compliment, when you say nice things to others, you feel good. The entire biochemistry activity of your body changes and it changes for the better. While National Say Something Nice Day provides a focus for sharing positive comments, positive words with others and with yourself, we do not have to limit nice words to a specific day. Let's make every day a day for sharing nice words and engaging in kind acts for no other reason than we can. If you're not yet following, Kindness Makes the World a Better Place and the Easy Stress Cures podcast, I invite you to follow both shows where you get your podcasts. To learn more about our work at Stress Relief Radio and to listen to other podcasts in our family of podcasts, visit our website at stressreliefradio.com. If you would like to be in touch, email me at cartermethod at gmail.com. Until our next visit together, I wish for you and your loved ones blessings in abundance.